What's going on, everybody? This is Super Live. James Clark back again with another live stream here on my channel. We're playing Pokemon Sword, and it appears that some great news has been dropped earlier today. The Pokemon Direct uh, announcing that there's some new DLC coming out for Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield later this year. Of course, we don't have to wait uh, too long for any new, uh, you know, ad or additional updates for the game. Tonight, we're going to go and try and catch a Slowpoke. I will uh, do everything that I can to make sure that we get a hold of it. And it turns out that we need to go to Wedgehurst Station. The game has been updated. There is a Slowpoke. It's supposed to be the start of the new DLC story. So we're going to try that out. But before we do that, let's go ahead and do our shoutouts because we got a few of you joining us at the beginning of this live stream. We've got DJ Galaxy the Umbreon, DJ5189, Joseph Man uh, Manska, Pasta Pasta, Squid Doodle, and Zen Lightning. Welcome to live stream, guys. Also joining us tonight are my moderators, Jamie Kleinkoff and Zach Carmen. Welcome to live stream, guys. All right, so we just got finished uh, defeating, uh, you know, the rock gym uh, leader. So we have to look around Church, uh, Sir Chester and see what it has to offer. Oh, never mind. Looks like we're going to meet with Sonya again. That battle was brilliant. That gym leader was tough, but you had no trouble. Sir Chester has some really great restaurants. I got some things I want to talk to you about, so let's head to a restaurant to celebrate your win. The name of the restaurant is Bob's Your Uncle. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Where'd you go? So I guess we have to go to a restaurant here real quick. I'm going to assume it's this one. Dio Overheaven, welcome to the live stream. What's going on, man? Got that gym badge, Jamie. Nice one. Oh, hey, there you are. I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day and the Sword and Shield Pokemon, but still no luck. Wait, hold on. No way. What's this? The heroes look sad, and where are the sword and shield? What was the meaning of this picture? Hmm, perhaps when their duty was completed, they went into some kind of sleep. Based on those statues we saw back in Stoneside, the sword and the shield were actually two Pokemon, right? That's right. That's my take on it, at least. Why does my stream keep ending and coming back on? That's a very good question. You remember the Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them? Either the Sword or the Shield Pokemon? You met them? Come on. You know what I'm talking about, right, Jamie? In the Slumbering Weald. Exactly. The mad Pokemon, we ran into the fog. Don't you think that could have been it? Oh, that's right. You lot have been in the slumbering wheel. I only started on this journey because my grand told me to, but this is turning out to be too much fun. You've got to tell me more. How about we discuss this over a meal? Go on. What do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in. Ah, oh, perfect. I'm starving. Wow, that was quick. Quick lunch. Fascinating. All right, the next thing to do now that we're done eating is to have a look around Sir Chester. Let's inspect the hero's bath. Uh, how about we not? Let's uh, head over to... Uh... Oh, never mind. They're going to make us go over here to this thing they call the hero's bath. I don't even know why they call it the hero's bath. Shadow King, Lukey Plays. What's up, guys? Welcome. Sunshine Nickerson, hello to you as well. Welcome to the live stream. The hero's bath. They say this is where the two heroes come to soothe their wounds after the battle to bring down the evil presence long ago. Nowadays, only Pokemon really use the hero's bath, though. Hmm. Who exactly were the heroes that bathed here? 
I think I'll have to look into that. Let's just hope the new rivals have more than two dimensions. <laughs> you two met a mysterious Pokemon back in the slumbering wheel. Perhaps you two can become new heroes. What? Like some hero waving around a sword and shield? Pull the other one? Though, I guess I'd fancy a shield if I had to take my pick. What kind of battle do you think the heroes had back then? Why don't we show her, Jamie? Think we could pull off a heroic battle? Absolutely. Sonya treated us to a great meal. After that curry, I feel like I've got a lot of energy to wrestle the, a, a beware. I don't entirely understand your reasoning, but I might just as well see what you can do. I'll heal up your Pokemon for you, Jamie. So give it your best. Nice. Time for a little exhibition match, starring the future champion. Uh, here we go again. Challenged by trainer Pokemon Hop. This is actually getting kind of boring. <laughs> Every time we start a new live stream, we start off with a battle against Hop. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shiny, shiny Pokemon. Counting on you, partner. Yeah, you sure is. It's hailing. Uh, yep, it sure is. Yeah, I might as well try some thunder, see what this does. He avoided the attack. Oh, good. I'll use takedown. Uh, it's not very effective. Uh, damage by the recoil. You hurt yourself there, buddy. There we go. Everybody's getting hurt. Try that again. Thunder. And Eagle Gamer, long time no see. What's going on, buddy? Thank you for joining us. Use defense curl. It's not going to be enough. Defense rose. Still not going to be enough. Ouch. Yeah. All right. One more time. And that's the end of Dub Wool. Any thoughts on the DLC? Uh, we'll get to that here shortly, Mystic Brothers. You love Hop, just think he didn't need so many battles. It gets a bit annoying. True. Ah, oh, poor Gyarados. Let's see what he's about to send out. Send out Pin... Pinkerchin. Yeah, let's switch Pokemon. Let's get Dio back out onto the uh, battlefield here. It's cool looking. I like I like the fact that they're doing that versus you know trying to like do like an Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon type deal, like where they do. You guys remember like they did black and white, then black and white version two, and then they did Sun and Moon, and then Ultra Sun and then Ultra Moon. Let's see how this works. That works. There's a Jutaro Pokemon. Nice, yes. <laughs> uh, let's see what moves we got here. Brick Break. Power 75. Hmm. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of that one. Animator the Gamer, welcome to livestream. How's it going? Thanks for joining us. Really want to try and uh, pick up that that uh, slow poke after this, guys. Aiden Miller, hello, welcome. Guys, thank you so much for being here tonight. We're live streaming Pokemon Sword. We just recently uh, learned about the the new. Uh, DLC that's going to be coming out here very, very soon. I think the first DLC... Well, actually, we have uh, an update which gives us an opportunity to pick up a Slowpoke, which is something that we'll get to here shortly. Super effective double kick! Was it very super effective, apparently? Now that's a proper move. Body slam. Oh, flattened like a pancake, but that's okay. Dio can handle it. 
one more double kick, and that should end Snorlax's turn here. He gone. Melanie Miller, Brian Field. Welcome to live stream. How are you all doing tonight? Pasta Pasta heading out. Uh, oh, Lukey Plays is heading out. All right, man. Take care. Have a great night, and we'll see you around, Lukey Plays. Cool. Uh, no. We're going to keep the old moves. Pikachu doesn't need to learn light screen. You think new, uh, the regions are awesome. I've wanted more additions for a while. The regions were just such a cool idea. We're happy that I bring it. Oh, Regis? I don't even know what that is. Jeremiah's in 310. What's up, man? He's about to send out Corviknight. Let's keep current Pokemon for now. Ah, uh, nerve. Do a flame charge. Ooh. So close to completely annihilating him. Scary face. It's not gonna work. It didn't work. Gino the random. Hello, welcome, buddy. Yeah, that works. We'll let the hail handle business. Cool. Awesome. Rillaboom. Rillaboom. Rillabloom. What, what, whatever. Uh, not even close. I'll be the greatest when I steal this win back. It's, uh... Yeah, it's it's Grookey. Well, sorry, not Grookey. The final uh, final evolution of Grookey. And this is not... This is not gonna be fair to him. I mean, but... That is what it is. Hey, man, that's what happens when you put fire against plant. See? Told you. And Hop is disappoint. Currently playing the new Pokemon Mystery Dungeon demo. Nice. Very cool, Brian. I still can't even beat you. My true rival, but I think I'm starting to see the light. Almost five grand there. Nice. Thanks, you two gave the right proper battle. At that rate, at the rate you're both going, even the unbeatable Leon may be in trouble. So what's next, you two? I plan to look into the things in the slumbering wheel. I'm going to keep challenging that gym. Then once I get that gym badge, I'll be heading for Route 9 to take on Spike Muth next. Spike Muth. McKirby McMonster. Welcome to livestream, buddy. How's it going? Seems like he finally shook off that gloom. Leon worry if Hop wasn't feeling all right. Ask his rival, you wouldn't like it either, right? See ya. Something about this uh, song kind of gives me a uh, Zelda vibe. You guys know what region I'm talking about, right? Yeah, let me know. Let me get know know if you guys recognize that background music there kind of reminds you of a, a certain song from a certain region in the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Alright, so what we're going to do now is we're going to go to our town map and we are going to go all the way back all the way down south to Wedgehurst and we are going to make an attempt to catch a Galarian Slowpoke. Wish me luck, guys. <clears throat> Alright, here comes the cutscene, I'm assuming. Ah, uh, yes, here we go, guys. The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived. Those with an armor pass, please board the train. I bet they're like... I bet the armor passes are like $30 and they probably are sold out until June. <laughs> I'm kidding. I hope you guys got my joke. Anyway, let's go ahead and talk to you. Uh, I believe this is... Who is this? This is... Do you have an armor pass? Of course I totally have one. Please allow me to check your pass. He's like, oh, please allow me to check your... Oh, here we go. Slowpoke. Slow. Oh, a slowpoke. Uh-oh. Looks like another one's gotten on the train and ridden over from the Isle of Armor. 
Slow. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? If slow, if slow poke blocks the ticket gate, it'll cause trouble for other customers. Slow poke are actually pretty heavy. So, do you think you could catch it for me? Slow. Battle slow poke in order to catch it? Well, I suppose. I mean, we got to do what's right for the, uh, you know, the locals. I mean, we can't just let a slowpoke interrupt, you know, traffic operations when it comes to trains, I'm assuming. All right, here we go. James, did you already get the DLC? No, not yet. I haven't purchased it yet, but right now we're doing the uh, whole slowpoke thing. What level is this guy in? Here we go. Ha, huh, nice. Gotcha, Slowpoke was caught. All right, guys, so I am gonna give everybody an opportunity to give Slowpoke, our newest Pokemon to our party, a proper name. So what do you guys think? What do you think? What should we name him? Would you like to give Slowpoke a nickname? Sure. All right, guys. So yes, we uh, we've got a uh, Slowpoke. Unfortunately, I I hear that the evolutions uh, are you know basically locked behind DLC specifics. Uh, for the for Pokemon Sword DLC, uh, you know it's gonna be the Galarian Slowbro. And then for those who are on Shield, who are playing Pokemon Shield, they'll get uh, Slow King, if I remember the direct correctly. So people are saying Pink Lemonade. Seriously, name it Lemon. <laughs> oh my gosh, Pink Lemonade. Somebody said name it Kirby. <laughs> Somebody said name it Pikachu. Pink Lemonade or just P Lemon for short. Yeah, I don't even think we could. Yeah, we only have uh, room for uh for 12 characters unfortunately mckirby mcmoss says dj dk jonathan because we need more jojo right so well i don't know i don't i don't i mean people who watch jojo's bizarre adventure would probably recognize that name but i think the general audiences would probably be like what the heck why did he name his slowpoke jonathan you know what i mean His head looks like a lemon. So pink lemon. Okay. We're going to we're going to call him pink lemon. All right, there we go. Thanks much. Slowpoke can be a big trouble to move sometimes. Yeah, I, I totally get it. I understand. I understand. I, I, I know what's going on here. You are a paid employment, uh, a paid employee of the Transit Authority, yet you have to rely on trainers to do your job. Gotcha. See, I know what's really going on here. <laughs> wow, amazing. The way you caught that slowpoke was the absolute coolest. We apologize for the wait. We have checked your armor pass. All aboard the train to the Ar Isle of Armor. Mind your step when boarding. Please be aware that there will be a connection along the way. Okay. I'm heading to a place called the Isle of Armor. I'm going to catch some rare Pokemon and do some training. Let's hang if we can if we meet up again, okay? Bye-bye. See ya. Hey, Brand Eyes Gaming is joining us today. Guys, give a warm welcome to Brand Eyes Gaming. He says the Pokemon Direct was pretty nice, although the DLC was a bit scummy. <laughs> uh, w would you agree that uh, um, the cost was a little 
much. I don't know. What do you think, Brand Eyes? Alright, so we need to go back to our map here. So we have to accomplish something. Let's pass through Route 9 to reach Spike Month. Such a unusual name for, uh, you know. Winden, Winden, that's all Winden. Route 10. Sir Chester. We need to go to Route 9. That'll take us to here, and that will take us to Spike Month. Can't go through the Route 9 tunnel. Wonderful. So, yeah, here we go. Let's take a flying taxi to Sir Chester. You. Yeah. You were honestly expecting Nintendo to charge like 40 bucks. You know, they could have potentially done a thing where, you know, they did like, I don't know, something weird again, like what they did with Black and White and Sun and Moon. Pokemon, Ultra, Sword, whatever, you know, or Ultra Shield. They could have potentially done that, but they are like, now let's just make a DLC for the next game. Honestly, maybe it's probably better that they just do DLC to follow up with Pokemon Sword from last last November's release. And then as the months go by, they can concentrate on developing a proper, proper Pokemon game for the Nintendo Switch. What do you guys think? I, I, I think that would be, would be, uh, you know, the best path for uh, Game Freak and the Pokemon Company to go. Then again, you know, it's their Pokemon, it's their franchise, they do what they want. And Paul, what's up, man? Welcome. In Germany, 30, yeah, 30 euros, yeah, figures. Imagine that, huh? Oh, whoops. Actually, let me see if I can go in here. Ah, I can. Uh, let's see if he can get you something. I wanted to have... Uh... No. Of course not. Nobody... Nobody gives us anything in some of these random places, I guess. They just... They're just filler spots, I guess. You know, you go in and talk to somebody and they're like, eh, whatever. Yeah. Figures. Alright. Still nothing. And uh, this is my favorite TM. Do you want to use it on your Pokemon? Sure. All right. Obtain TM twenty seven icy wind. Outstanding. The user attacks with a gust of chilled air. This also lowers opposing Pokemon speed stats. If you want to collect technical records or TRs, check dens in the wild area and have max raid battles. Something that I'm looking forward to doing with everybody when we get to the post game. Which has been a grind, and I do apologize, guys. Sometimes I wish I could live stream this game for 12 hours straight. But, uh, you know, the reality is, you know, I can't. <laughs> so I gotta live stream whenever, you know, I have time uh, to do it. I may not look the part, but I completed the gym challenge back in the day. Oh, nice. Good game. Good game. Alright. Gotta heal our Pokemon because we had that battle with Hop. Because Hop just does not know uh, does not know when to quit. I mean, at least he's got that going for him, you know. Can we just give some major props to the GF marketing and trailer teams for making the wild areas seem. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> dude. Um, it is very. Uh, it is smaller than I was led to believe. I was just like you there, Mystic Brothers. I thought it was going to be this huge Breath of the Wild type wild area deal. And, uh, no. No. Totally wrong. Totally wrong. My expectations were all the way... Like, they were just... They were just unrealistically high after they showed that trailer. And I'm like, the wild area. And I'm like, oh my god, that is amazing. It's like Breath of the Wild all over again. Nope. It's like from here to my the end of the block. That's how big the uh, 
That's how big the uh, the wild area is in uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield. Everybody was expecting it to be big, large, humongous. Oh, what is this place? Hotel Iona, huh? Okay. Oh, nice. It lets us go up the elevators, too. Cool. Oh, is this going to be like uh, that ship um, where we uh, battle people? Sounds of scratching glass or screeching noises feels like they suck the energy right out of you, don't they? Take this TM. It can cause that kind of effect. Nice. Alex Martinez, what's up, man? Welcome to live stream. How's it going? Your splitting screech harshly lowers the target's defense stat. Be awful if you heard a screeching sound like that in the middle of the night. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I don't think anybody would want to hear that. Um, I, I'm thinking it's going to be like SS Anne where we battle everybody. You know what I mean? You guys remember that, right? So many Pikachus. Tears are powerful. When I see them, I let my guard down without even noticing it. Do you want to use a TM that takes advantage of this power? Sure thing. All right, TM 47. I guess this is all about uh, technical machines. So we're gonna just pick. We're just gonna talk to all these people and uh, get some free stuff, I suppose. Watch this little kid want to challenge me in a battle. I'll become the champion using an all Pikachu team. Heck, yeah, good luck with that, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> a kid can dream, right? He can dream. Alright, so let's check the other side here. I've been waiting for my wife. Well, actually, my wife's been making me wait. But being blunt with someone isn't always the right thing to do. Alright, let's see what's in here. When you beat the game, are you gonna... Let's see here. So, when you beat the game, are you going to be ready to get absolutely slaughtered by your lovely viewers? Not really, no. I'm not excited about that. Who would be excited about that, Mystic Brothers? Anyway, so that means the culprit must be among us. Wait, who are you? Surprise guest. After all the trouble of des deducing things, don't go messing it up now. It's a guessing game? We're accused of being criminals. Will you help us out? I just want to be let go soon. Where did my Pokemon go off to? Alright. Talk to this guy. See what he says. I suppose I should introduce myself. The name's Houses. Yes, that Houses. The great detective. I've been hired by the hotel. At present, I have cornered the culprit of a most heinous crime. And that crime is... A strange case of who ate the large quantity of berries in the lobby. And gather the three people here who were present at the lobby at the time of the crime. But because of the noise, my marvelous deductive reasoning seems somewhat muddled at present. That's it. You, interfering child, you will be my assistant. Listen to the stories of each suspect and find the culprit. Certainly. I, I think I know where this is going. It was definitely a Pokemon that ate those uh, berries. Looks like you were unlucky enough to get caught up in this too. It was a huge pile of berries in the lobby, right? There's no way I could have eaten that many. I've been saying this the whole time. The detective sure seems like trouble, doesn't he? I will admit that I saw the mountain of berries, but my doctor told me to stop eating those things. I got it in writing right here. Where did my Pokemon go off to? Huh? Berries? I didn't eat them. Hey, you haven't seen my Pokemon around here, have you? Yeah, it's gonna be a Pokemon. Aha! That little guy. I believe it's called, uh, Choodle? Ch or whatever. Ah, my Pokemon. Where were you? Eating berries, apparently. Munch. Sure has a lot of berry juice on its mouth. <laughs> After listening to everyone's accounts, I have deduced the culprit. Dancer, you are the culprit. No, absolutely not. What? Why me? Because you're a dancer. You move and shake your body so much that you need all that food for extra energy. This guy is a horrible detective. That's evidence as clear and sharp as the leak on of a far-fetched. What? What does that even mean? 
You're no detective. You're a fraud. Yeah, he's totally a fraud. Who are you calling a fraud? You can't be referring to me, the great detective. I can't deal with this disrespect. I leave it to you. You find the culprit. I found him. He's right here. It's this, it's this, it's this, this squirrel thingy. Whatever he's called. I forgot what it's called. Promch. Could this be the culprit? Yes, this is the culprit. What? That squovet is the one responsible? There we go. It's a squovet. Ah, it's true. I got it. Got eh, blah, blah. <laughs> I can talk. It's got berries, berry bits around its mouth. Oh my gosh! Yes, it definitely ate the berries. Definitely. Oh, you're right. I see how uh, I look more closely. All right, Mystic Brothers, have a great night. Thanks for dropping by, buddy, and we'll see you around. As as expected of my assistant here. Recompense for solving this mystery. Take it. Oh, we obtain a wide lens. Put the wide lens in the other item's pocket. Splendid. Just splendid. I'm overjoyed. I must be off now. Take care, everybody. Bye. Yeah, he's like out of there. Hey, you just wait a minute. Uh, I guess I'm supposed to chase after him, too. Oh, silly, silly Pokemon. Thanks for solving the case. Quovet is saying you did good too. Nice. Glad I could be of assistance. Goku Black, what's up, man? Not much. How you been, dude? Thanks for coming by and joining us on today's live stream. Ah, uh, this guy. Trubbish is so helpful. He eats rubbish instead of taking tips. Oh, I guess that's it. All right. So cool. All right, so we're good to go there. Uh, I think we've talked about, or talked to just about everybody we need to talk to here. So back downstairs, I suppose. Yes, he was embarrassed, indeed. He uh, couldn't, he couldn't accept the fact that he uh, screwed up. Waiting for someone. By no bats using its ultrasonic waves to help look. All right, we can't go anywhere else. Uh, yeah, front row seats to the... T yeah, yeah. Awesome. Okay. So, not... Not a waste of time. It was definitely worth going in there and getting the TMs that we needed. Um, and plus it was fun to be, you know, playing detective there for a little bit. Another hotel. Can't sleep without Whimsicott's lovely floof. Okay. Welcome to Hotel Ionic. We were... What? So there's two of them. Uh, yeah, we'll just go upstairs. See, uh, see what else we can get a hold of here. Oh, there's somebody we could talk to here. Uh, ever since I was a kid, the hallways of hotels have always made me feel like I've got lo or I've got lost somewhere. It's not that bad, I promise. Ooh, <laughs> this time they got the cops involved. What's going on now? <laughs> they, got, they got this guy here. Hello there. What's this? Did you need something from me? Right. Why don't you run along for now? But come back when you're as strong as a champion, would you? Ah. Came here to research a bit, but the Galara region is lovely, isn't it? The best part of all had to be enjoying the different toppings on all the curries. Curry's a bit a big hit in Kanto too, you know. Completely obsessed with Rotom Rally. I can't get enough of it. Okay. Oh, it's Detective Guy. Do you like Pokemon? Yes. Well, thanks for that. I hope you will always love them. What, you guys thought, you guys thought I was going to say no? <laughs> oh, wait, I went through the... I uh, forgot to go to the end of the hall. And go. Ah, oh, I missed again. It's harder than it looks to get a catch. Hmm, you? You look like you know the proper way to throw a Pokeball. She must be playing Pokemon Go. Uh, go. Hi, I'm the director. 
Well, look at you. You're trying to complete the Pokédex, are you? Thanks for that. Keep on searching out new Pokémon to catch. Oh, I know. I've got just the thing to help you catch more and more Pokémon. You obtain the Catching Charm. You put the Catching Charm in your bag's key items pocket. Holding it is said to increase the chance of getting a critical catch. Curiously, the charm doesn't shake much. What? Come back and tell me when you've completed that Pokédex of yours. Oh, guys, help me complete my Pokédex. <laughs> the fourth wall has been broken. Yes, Aiden, it has. Uh, what is the director's name from Game Freak who developed this game? Does anybody know? Trivia question. Ooh, who will have the correct answer? <laughs> Everybody's Googling it right now as I speak. <laughs> I'm a planner. My job is to think of ways to play. Eh, so I suppose that means that playing itself is my job. What? Hear that background music? Yep, I made that. Oh, sure you did. Sure you did. His name is, um, Nintendo? No. No. Uh, he, uh... He, he, he works for Game Freak, who developed this game for Pokemon for the Pokemon Company. Only after you master basic moves can you engage in more advanced battles. That's what I learned from Karate. I heard that some wild Pokemon soak in hot springs to heal their injured bodies. Alright, somebody give me something. Otherwise, this is going to be a wasted trip. Last door. The partner is a germaphobe. It's been it's been taking a shower forever, even though it's a ground type. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Wow. Pokemon that are concerned about their own hygiene. Wonderful. Alright, so we need to... Yes, that that is the director. Yes, that's the director from Game Freak uh, that was involved in the de in the development of Pokemon Sword. Oh, interesting. I didn't know this was down here. Is there anything of... In oh, there is. Here we go. Got a Poke Doll. Alright, nothing else down here. Go to the other side now. the snowball an item to be held by a pokemon it boosts attack if the holder is hit with an ice type attack it can only be used once of course they they all can only be used once let's take a look at the town map here can't wait to see me catch a galarian slowpoke we already did it squid doodle yeah it's already done dude yeah it's already done Already done. The expansion pay a pass is paid content. You'll be directed to the Nintendo eShop. Your game won't be closed, and you can resume it later. I'll buy it later. Under the wild snom. It is. It's very cold here uh, in this region in Sir Chester. Oh, nice. We caught it. Awesome. Nice. Alright. Brutal level whatever. Awesome. Alright, so this is a snom. 
It spits out thread imbued with a frigid sort of energy, and it uses its uses it to tie its body to branches, disguising itself as an icicle while it sleeps. Wonderful. Uh, no, we're not gonna we're not gonna give it a nickname. What was I thinking? All right, we want to get out of here, or we'll not get out of here, but we want to move on. That's what we want to do. So let's see, where am I at on the map? It says here I'm going the wrong way. Oops. Let's go back the other way. There we go. Alright, now we're on the right path. All right, time to battle somebody. Rowan J, gamer, hello, welcome. Being a trainer can only mean battle. What a simple concept. Yes, simple indeed. But it will not be simple for you. We are challenged by Fisher Harriet, who probably has. Oh, cool, Parasputa. Nice. completed this game and also Pokemon Shield too. Nice, man. Good job. I wish I had, uh, you know, as much time to, you know, play video games as uh, everyone else does. But, you know, work, you know, work prevents me from, you know, playing things as much as I would like to. It is what it is. Alright, I gotta switch out to Dio here. Apparently, I can't use lightning against them. You only have Pokemon Sword. It's easy. The two time. Or it's SB the two time. What? Ah, uh, that was cool. Uh, I'm just, I'm just, all I'm doing is, uh, just, you know, killing time. Ooh. Maybe I can just give him a berry. I hate to I hate to waste it. All right, there we go. All right, see you there, Aiden Miller. Oh, we should use the Pyro Ball instead of the, uh, oh no, not Aqua Jet. Dang, man. That sucks. And there we go. Flame Charge. That ought to do it. Cool. And is she going to send out another Pokemon? She probably is. Yeah, she's got another Pokemon. There we go, Hyper Potion. You beat Mega Man 11 today, it was pretty awesome. Nice, dude, or pretty sweet. Cool, man. Bubble Beam. Ah, no. No, no, no. No! Dang it, Dio. We gotta end this. We gotta end this fast. She's Pyro Ball. What? What? That said, it was not very effective. 
Ah, dang it. No. No. Oh, never mind. Oh, that ends the battle. The game's easy, but finishing the Pokedex is hard. The stronger one always wins. How simple. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Nice. Try catching this Pokemon here. What is this? This is a M Marini. I wonder how this works on him. Oh, avoided the attack. Nice. Very cool. Very cool. I love it when they avoid attacks. That's awesome. Try that again. It's like a, a wasted turn, you know, because you lose you lose that. Cool. Oh wait, I was supposed to catch it, not kill it. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. All right, let's move on. Since I, I'm failing at the... Uh, oh. My Pokemon are all pumped up from dancing with me. Are you ready for us? And... No. Uh, okay, we're going up against Dancer Zoe. Going against a Darumaka. Probably should have uh, brought out a. Uh, probably move Dio to where he's out front. Let me try Hyper Beam. Let's see how this works. He avoided the attack. Apparently. Apparently, Gyarados has powerful attacks, but. Everybody dodges. So there's something wrong with. Uh, there's something wrong with Gyarados' speed. Yeah, that works. Ouch. Velossum? No, let's switch per uh, Pokemon here. Let's get uh, Dio back out here. Orange975, what's up, man? Time for me to prep a new team for the DLC packs? Yeah, I know, right? Uh, which one do you have, Orange? Are you getting, uh... Um, the Isle of Armor or uh, the uh, Tundra Crown or the Crown Tundra. Dang that attack, man. Jojo Day Pokemon. Yes, be cool. You can thank one of my sponsors for that name. <laughs> Wow, you and your Pokemon make a combo that throws out moves like an elegant dance. Sure. Sure, we'll, we'll say that. Yeah. They're both included, so both, yeah. Route 9, Sir Chester Bay. I, I, I have a feeling we're going to be going up against these guys. There's no way we're letting... You anywhere near Spike Muff, and that means we can't let you go on to Route 9. Okay. This team yells duty to cheer on these lovely Dredna. And we also get to stop people from heading out over the water. Mm hmm. Yes, I understand. All I'm saying is that I can, I can make it so that Rotom bikes can ride on water. Why we meet again, my young gym challenger friend. Remember me? I gave you that bike. So do you think you could do me another favor and teach these ruffians a lesson or two? It's our duty to protect Dreadnought. 
And that means you're gonna need to give up on the gym challenge. You look like you're needing convincing, so how about a Pokemon battle? Sure. Unknown Gaming, hello, welcome. Hat plant, a plant in time, hello to you as well. Yeah, so far so good there, uh, Unknown. I appreciate you coming by and joining us tonight, man. I'll send you packing for the sake of Dreadnought, of course. Listen, you guys are misunderstanding the point of this. All we're trying to do is advance. We're not trying to, you know, cause any trouble. We just want to move on. That's all. That's all we want to do. But if you guys insist on battling, yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. <sighs> it's good practice for me anyway, right? All right, so she sent out Leon. Leon. And pressure. And it's hailing. Oh, Intimidate. Don't miss. She's looking at Gyarados and she's like, oh man, this is not good. There we go. Moving on. Next. Throw out your next Pokemon. Angoro, nice. Keep current Pokemon. Yes, this was donated to me by uh, Shadow Player Seven. Anyway, if you watch my last live stream, uh, somebody donated him to me, and it actually helped immensely during the Rock Gym battle. Ooh, bounce is super effective, apparently. Nice. Use taunt. Buffeted by the hail, and here comes. Oh, bullet punch. Nice. Avoid of the attack. Here does use bounce. Avoid of the attack. Oh, that's not cool. That's not cool at all. Alright, well, we need to end this battle. Still gonna go for the super effective bounce attack. Oh, you got a uh, shiny shed ninja. Come on, man. He avoided the attack again. There's gotta be something going on here. I hate wasting those uh, special moves, but hey, man, what the heck? A shiny is a shiny. Uh, I used bounce twice, and Pangora managed to uh, avoid both of those attacks. Yeah, the shield game has a ghost type gym instead of a lightning, and the rock replaces ice. Exactly. Oh, uh, don't count him out yet, guys. We still gotta, we still gotta battle the other guy. All right, give it up. Hook us up. Wait, it's like sub-zero temperatures there, I imagine. Yet there, where? Well, you know what? I mean, she's out here in a skirt, a dress skirt, so it's not like my character is any better. Just gonna ride the dreadnought. Oi, I've got an idea. We can get on dreadnought first and ride it away. All right, get a move on, Dreadnought. See you later, Jim Challenger. Seems you come to my aid again. How's the cycling life been treating you? Are you having fun? Would it be great if you could ride your rotom bike on the water too? That's why I'm going to add these special parts, allowing it to travel along the water's surface, just for you. Awesome. Already, so there we go. This bike can be combined with the Pokemon Rotom to not only do a turbo boost but also run on the water. All right, all right. With the Rotom bike water mode, you'll cruise across the water like a Pokemon with swift swim. By the by, when you're riding on land, we'll call it land mode. Landmaster.
Nice, got a big pearl. Awesome. Haha, <laughs> nice. I guess I couldn't avoid all of them. Alright, so we're going up against a Mantine. See if we can catch this guy. No, of course not. Alright. You violated our policy. You must be defeated. Surround himself with a veal of water. Oh man, Gyarados is not having a very good day. Alright, you should have got caught, man. It would have been a lot easier for you. Now you fainted. Ricardo Rivera, hello, welcome. You're gonna shiny hunt Galara Slowpoke. Nice. Probably have to do that when you reach the Isle of Armor uh, or the uh, the uh, Crown Tundra. Oh, you can easily get lost around here, man. This is this is a joke, right? This is a joke. Are they are they getting ready to do the polar bear pl uh, plunge here? Is that what they're getting ready to do? Certainly it is a beach, but it's just too cold. Oh my gosh, man. You've got to be kidding me with this. What do you think about my secret beach? It's a small, mysterious paradise located on the very cool ocean. You've come all the way here, so I'll give you a present. Alright, so we obtained TM45 Dive. Awesome. What does this do? Diving on the first turn, the user floats up and attacks on the next turn. Nice. The move, dive. Your Pokemon won't be hit by attacks while it's diving in the water. That's right. It may be similar to my beach, which is so cold that nobody visits. <laughs> Alright. So, in other words, this guy is here visiting her? And it's her beach? I don't know, man. Oh my gosh, there we go. TM22, Rock Slide, nice! Dude, we're just getting all kinds of TMs today. Oh, we're back. Just had to send some messages. No problem there, Orange975. Appreciate you coming back and hanging out with us, dude. Thanks for the support, guys. We got 22 likes in the live stream. That is awesome, guys. Thank you so much for the support. Alright. I'm doing research to see if one day I can swim anywhere with my beloved Toxapex. Alrighty, so here we go. We're going up against Swimmer Layla. Alright, she sent out a Toxapex. We sent out the Gyarados. Have I pre-ordered the DLC yet? No, I'm going to do it off stream. Yeah, I'm going to pre-order it off stream. Let me try Thunder. Okay, what in the world is going on? Apparently the IVs on this uh, shiny Gyarados are not so good. It is what it is, though. A shiny is a shiny said somebody in the uh, in, in my viewer audience there well at least he's not gonna miss this one that's good does anyone think world of light every time they see that that hyper beam from from smash brothers you guys know what i'm talking about right <laughs> bam the gyarados must recharge Vino Shock. Oh no, Gyarados is down. Wow, look at you. Look at you, Toxapex. You're so big. You're so strong. 
He defeated my Gyarados with, well, I don't know, apparently the IVs are not, they're not good on, uh, th or on, uh, Gyarados, but hey, free Pokemon, you know, free shiny Pokemon. Can't go wrong with that. Alright, try and dodge this. No, don't do that. Good, protect yourself. Good job, it protected itself. Oh, and we're poisoned. Awesome. I love this game. I expressed my frustrations with uh, poison type Pokemon in the uh, previous Pokemon game we featured on my channel. Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I didn't think it was cool. I didn't like it very much. I mean, poison Pokemon. Uh, after that battle, do you want to trade? What kind of Pokemon do you want to trade there, Brian? Alright, so we defeated Swimmer Layla. Is this the limit of water types? No, I can still come up with more. It's making that Frieza pouty face. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? As she grips her hand like that, you know what I mean? I just, I don't know. It's that usual Frieza pouty face. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? Right? No? Nobody? Come on. Hey, can we not speak of Let's Go like ever? <laughs> nice, Orange. I take it you're a fan? I'm kidding. You don't have to answer that question. You want to give me something. Ah. Uh, well, give me a moment here to... This medicine can be used to fully restore the PP... Gosh, that doesn't sound right. Why do they use... They should have had me on the development team. I would have been telling them, it's like, no, no, no. No, don't do that. Because, you know, PP could be synonymous with, you know what, the yellow stuff, or PowerPoint. Let's let's call it something else. You know what I mean? Why couldn't they call it energy points? You know what I mean? Oh my gosh, there's more trainers. There's trainers all over this map. Alright. We'll focus on that later. We need to further this plot. As I run into another Pokemon. Countered a, 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 a wild bird bite. He broke free. Oh, now he's going to use... Oh, nice. He avoided the attack. I didn't do so much. Wait, why is Dreadnought out here? I just realized that. It's like Dreadnought's out here. Shouldn't I have... Yeah, let's get Dio back out here. Real quick. Need to uh, adjust and change my, uh, my Pokemon on my team. Cover. Oh, recover. Oh, just like that. Back to full health. Look at you. Look at you, Bergmite. Wow, man. He doesn't need a trainer to heal. Although, my uh, my Dio, he definitely needs a trainer to heal. Alright, let me try Pyro Ball, see if, see if this works. I'm hoping for an instant kill with this attack. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Good stuff. Good job there, Dio. Yeah, Nintendo has made some pretty suggestive names in the past, like the Super and Ultra. Yes, yes. Oh yeah, and and, and Pokeballs. Yeah, opening the world to all kinds of jokes. I mean, let's face it, you know. <laughs> I mean, even as we age, you know, you know, our maturity still hasn't changed. You know what I mean? Frank and Chi, what's up, man? What's going on? Scope lens. An item to be held by a Pokemon. It's a lens for scoping out weak points. It boosts the holder's critical hit ratio. Ooh, I like that. We should give that to... Well, no. No, uh, Sir, uh... Sir Frank a lot needs the, uh... What's it called? Um... The leak. What's going on here? Hmm, interesting. 
This looks like some sort of cinematic or an event or something. I can't enter Spike Month, so I've just been hanging around here this whole time. No one can challenge a dark type leader like this. What's the gate being shut? How am I supposed to get the gym badge now? Hey, Jamie. Oh, where'd she go? Oh, here we go. I was born here. Oh, I was born here, so I know another way in. If you want to get into the town, how about I show you the way? But you're my rival, so you have to beat me in a battle first. Got it? <sighs> okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. I forgot to... Uh... Dang it. I forgot to switch out my Pokemon. Dang. Alright, so we're challenged by Pokemon trainer Marnie. Sent out Lipard. Yeah, I, I didn't heal any of my Pokemon. Out up a whole lot. I'm going to beat you a lot, a lot into the ground, sure. Nasty plot. Not too much, just got home from work with Breen Galarian Slowpokes, also trying to figure out the mystery of it all. Use Torment. And that uh, subjected to Torment. Use Rock Tomb. Still not enough. Oh, due to tournament. Oh, gotcha. Well, we'll use Water Gun then. Hyper Potion. Oh, look at you. Healing your Pokemon. Good job. Good job. Dang, man. You rock to him again. Up, oh, Sucker Punch. Nice job. Come on, Dreadnought. You got this, buddy. You got this. I know you do. You love the uh, Galarian Slowpoke? Yeah. He's pretty cool. Whoops. Not very effective, huh? Nasty plot. Well, I thought your speed fell. works. Oh, that's right. That rock team. Well, this should finish Lightbird off. Nasty plot. Speed increases, but this rock smash will uh, defeat him. Alright, so Lightbird's down. Three more Pokemon to go. Scrafty, huh? Oh, that's right. Yeah, I can't use that. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and revive our our fallen comrades here. Brick break, dang. Nice.
Dang it. That is really annoying. He just needs to stop missing. He... Wow. Well, at least he used it on him. That's good. Dang it. That's horrible. Ah, oh, those dang status effects, man. Can I use a... He's a fighting type Pokemon, right? So Frankenstein says his nephew just asked him why breed them, and he responded, because they exist. Yes. That's a good point. Very good. I like that. I like that. That's funny. No, keep the current Pokemon. Poison Jab? Of course you would use Poison Jab. Why, why would you resort to such dirty tactics? Oof. That's not good. Not very effective. Critical hit, though. I, although... I don't know. Huh. I'm sure, let's get, uh... Let's get Toga de Maru out here. Use some lightning attacks. Poison jab. Doesn't affect him. Good. Sucker Punch. Dude! The heck! Another Sucker Punch. Wow. Battle went a lot longer than I had expected. Yeah, I'll, I'll trade with you, Brian. Yeah. Just gotta finish this match, man. More Pico. Oh, I remember more Pico. As expected, my rival, you really know how to get me riled up. All right, we're gonna send. Uh, we're gonna send Dreadnought out. While Jodon's out there, we're gonna try to. Uh, Try to put an end to this real quick. Hopefully it works out. Use Bite. Using Bite on a Dreadnought. Oh, wow. That was a very effective uh, strategy there. Nice. Who would have thought that, uh, you know, a more Piku, whatever, would be able to do that. But, yeah, good, good. Good for her. Good for her. All right, Pikachu, you got this. Not very effective. Uh, effective. Oh, a quick attack is effective. That's it? Nice. Good job. I kid, of course. Alright, so while that's happening, let's go ahead and try to heal our Pokemon. Oh, dang. I don't like that. I don't like that very much.
You can't trade? Uh, no worries, man. There's always another time. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, Brian, we'll handle it. We'll handle it. Just give me a moment here while I uh, put Dio back on the field here. All right, Dio. We need you to end this match, buddy. This has gone on for far too long. Far too long. All right, that ends the match. All right, good. All right, so we defeated her. What's with that? My Pokemon didn't get a chance to really do their thing at all. Ugh. All right, so we got 5,280 for winning. Outstanding. Very good, very good. Partner Morpico has been interested in you and your strength, and I think I get it now. But I've got everyone in Spike Month support me. I'm definitely going to get all eight gym badges just so I can have a rematch with you. Don't you forget it. I'll get my revenge in the Champions Cup. Anyway, I promised I'd show you a way in, so follow me. Awesome. Okay, so uh, the plot furthers. All right, right after the cinematic there, Brian. I, I wasn't expecting this. All right, so here we are at Spike Muth. What a uh, unusual name. We've got to heal our Pokemon. That definitely needs to happen. Awesome. All right, so initiate communication, connect to the internet. Alright, so now we just wait. It should work. Alright guys, by the way, we've got 12 of you watching the live stream right now. Guys, thank you so much for your support. And also, 23 likes on the live stream. That is awesome, guys. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you for the interest. And guys, if you know anyone else who would like to join us on tonight's live stream, be sure to, uh, you know, let them know. Share this through various social media platforms like Twitter, Facebook, Discord... Uh, the share button is actually just below the video there. If you click on that, uh, you should be able to share on, uh, you know, whatever uh, social media platform you guys, uh, you know, use. All right, so right now it's searching. I don't know if, uh, yeah, hmm. I guess it takes a lot longer than expected. I did enter that code in, just like you said, Brian. For some reason, it's not coming up. No idea why, man. Yeah, I already set the link code. Yeah, the link the link code's already set. I'll uh I'll cancel it and I'll try again. Oh, you're from Australia? Alright. Well, I'm gonna keep moving, uh, because, you know, you know, we're limited on time anyway. With the shutter closed, nobody's gonna be able to do, or to do, or to challenge the gym. I gotta look into this. I just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one, got it? You can handle yourself, right? Alright, we got Pierce League card. You can... Or you put the uh, league card in your album. Awesome. All right, so let's take a look. 
Oi, welcome to Spike Mouth, kid. Hope you're ready for the gym mission. Hold on, mate. If you're gonna take on the gym mission, you'd better change into your uniform. If you're looking for the gym leader, he's straight ahead from here. Alright, so this is the dark type gym. This isn't the gym challenge. Yeah. Yeah, this ain't no gym challenge. And this is gonna be so bad if, uh, if Gyarados misses. Am I interested in the spike uh, in the uh, expansion packs? Yeah, absolutely. Let's see these uh, thunder again. Yeah. I don't want to let you through. That's why I was waiting all... Waiting all squeezed in this crack. But since I lost, it wasn't really all for nothing. Whatever, you won. So I guess I'll step aside. Yeah, this ain't no gym challenge. Oh, it is the, uh, okay, so this is the, uh, gym challenge. Yeah. That is the gym challenge. Wow, what a weird setup. Alright, so we need to, we need to reevaluate the situation here. One of the first things that I want to do is I want to, uh, remove, uh, Gyarados from the party. He needs to go. And we need to replace him with somebody else. So let's see here. Um, Gyarados, move. Uh, we've got Jotaro. We're going to need to level up Jotaro. He needs to level up. Put him there for now. We'll move Dio. Yeah, move Dio there. Move Jotaro here. Uh, we'll move Pikachu to a Pokebox. Uh, dark Pokemon, are they susceptible to fairy-type attacks? Hold on, let me, let me check his move set real quick. Psychic and Fairy. Move sets include Psycho Cut, Fairy, Wind, Psy Beam, and Confusion. Bug Fighting and Fairy are strong against Dark. Nice. All right, so we can we definitely want Rapidash back on the team. The Rapidash moves. We'll move. Yeah, we'll move Jotaro. We're gonna level up Jotaro. Jotaro definitely needs to level up. We don't have a lot of Bug type Pokemon, but we do have Sir Frankichu, and he's got a Bug type move. Next summary Bug type move is. Uh, Fury Cutter. Yeah. Yeah, we'll leave it. We'll leave, uh, Sir Frankichu in there. Uh, we've got a Butterfree, level 35. Oops, let's check that. Uh, Bug Flying Grass Electric. Hmm. Alright, so, oops, no, that's not what I wanted. Check summary on this one. Grass and dark, we don't need that. 
dark type moves will do times one damage against Rapidash. What does that mean there, Frankichu? Does that mean, uh... Does that mean that, uh, Rapidash is gonna have a bad day? Hey, DJ Riolu, welcome. Goku Senior saying, God, hello, welcome. Uh, we'll half damage while Psychic type will deal double damage, putting both, bo uh, putting both together. Ah. Oh, okay, levels out will be fine. Nice. I don't remember what he had in his move set. Water and rock. Normal. We need fighting type attacks. And Snorlax has the normal. St no. Dang. We're low on the bug types here. Don't have a lot of bug types on our uh, party. Oh, he's level 12. He's definitely not going to be able to uh, handle this battle. Whoops. There we go. Nice. All right, we want, we want, we want fairly, uh, whatever his name is. Phalanx, there we go. Psychic. Aha! Fusion. Uh, you know what? You know what? I think we can use a TM. Yeah, we we can we can have sl yeah. Let's oh no no get back in there. Yeah, we can get uh, we can get slow poke where we need him. We just need to get the uh, uh, rare candies out. I think. I don't know. I could be wrong. Worth a shot, though. I don't know. You guys think it's worth it? Oh, uh, straight sacking is it a good idea? Ah, oh, darn. Okay. Alrighty. Alright, so... He's gotta go. Unfortunately. We'll level him up some other time. What I want to know is why in the world did they put him at such a low level when we're so high up there in level? You know what I mean? That was just really weird. Oh. That's better than nothing. All right. Yeah, that's true. Alright, good. Oh, 
Oh, what a waste. I should have used a small candy. Dang it. Uh, all right. Let's see how many points this gives him. 3,000. One more. I at least got him to level 40. Don't know what we're going to do with Machoke, though. He wants to learn counter. Retaliation move that counters any physical attack and flinch can double, double the damage taken. Hmm. I don't know if I want to use that. Yeah, we'll give up on that. Sorry, guys. We're really, really trying to... Uh, I'm just trying to make sure that... Uh, Nice. There we go. Um, strength, huh? Target a slug with a punch thrown at maximum power. Hmm. There we go. All right. Oh. All right, see what happens when I use 12. All right, gets it up to level 35. Use all of them. Oh, man, only up to level 37. Wants to learn the move Dual Chop. Okay, what does that do? Use your attacks as target by hitting with it with brutal strikes. The target is hit twice in a row. Accuracy 90, power 40. It's a dragon type move. What? Welcome back, Orange. Good to see you. Am I going to do raid battles? No, not tonight. Right now, I'm trying to focus on trying to uh, get ready for uh, the, the next uh, gym battle. Because we need to move, we need to further this plot. We need to get through. Yeah, we need to be done with this game, so that we can do those raid battles and do those, uh, you know, you know, complete the Pokédex and all the other stuff that I promised to do with you guys. I'm right, gonna get rid of Scary Face. I, I don't see, you know, an advantage to using that. There we go. 3,000. Leveled up again. And... Uh, just use all the extra small candies. Might as well. Not... We don't have any 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 need for... Oh, wow. Only 1,000. Okay. that That's as much as we can go. And uh, we're gonna need to... Oh, I can purchase more items. Awesome. I'm here to buy... Alright. Van Buren 20, but a video... Wait, hold on a second. There's a big Mario Kart 
tournament going on next weekend. The top eight winners get 2,500 My Nintendo. Yes, I am aware of that, and I will be participating on all four nights for that event. Thanks for waiting. Cinder Ace and the rest of your team should be all better now. Nice. Let's get going. It's time to uh, take on the gym challenge. Yeah, all right, we're ready. What's this? A gym challenger made it through? All his team yell members have blocked the way. Don't think we just will just let you waltz through though. No, it's it's fine, Zach. Alright, send out Feeble. Dang, that was instant. Hey, Kevin M, what's up, dude? Welcome to the live stream. How's it going? Guys, please give a warm welcome to another one of my sponsors. Also, he's a YouTube gaming content creator and live streamer. He just got finished live streaming Mario Kart Double Dash on his channel. Yep, Kevin M joining us in the live stream chat. I wasn't able to properly greet you. Yes, you were not able to properly greet me. Nice job. That was totally unbelievable. Even my Pokemon are in awe of you and your team. Here, go on through. Check out our neon signs where, while you're at it. Bari, Bari. Okay. I'm yelling for no reason. Yeah, oh, and they crashed. Did I surprise you? I'm a little surprised how much my legs hurt from that land. If I stand like this for so, if I still stand still like this for too long, it'll hurt. I so bad I might cry. So I'll shake it off with the battle. Oh, you told uh, Kevin about my live stream. Thanks, Zach. I appreciate that, buddy. Sent out Crafty or Scrafty, whatever. Scrafty. Apparently, Scrafty does not like uh, double kicks, and he's still alive. Dairy face. It doesn't work. Oh, never mind. It does work. Your stream died at the end, but it was a takeover, so you're fine. What do you, what do you mean by a takeover? It's the second best uh, Mario Kart fall behind Mario Kart Wii, in your opinion? Really orange. Oh, you'll explain. Sounds good, man. Yeah, I'm kind of interested to know what exactly happened. All right, I lost. My leg paints back, so it's a double shock. Cool. <laughs> uh, I guess we showed him. Well, it's true that I lost, but I pushed through the pain, so you should praise me for that. All right, now that the pain's gone, I guess I'd better get out of here. Cool. All right, so what's this here? Now the max revive. Nice. Oh, it's another mime thing. HP of your Pokemon, not looking so good. Don't know what you're talking about, ladies. I practiced that back handspring so much, even a pop star would be jealous of those moves. 
Pop star. Okay, so were you surprised? Oi, be surprised, you. While you're in utter shock, I'm gonna sneakily win this battle. No, you're not. Basically, for my own words, if you see any old Let's Plays that need improvement or you want me to do it so badly on my channel and I approve of it, I... Oh, gotcha. Okay, I get it, Kevram. I had to read it a couple of times. Oh, your first stream takeover. Gotcha. One of your users will pick a random game. Gotcha, buddy. That sounds like a pretty awesome idea, man. Starting to see a Weevil's Pressure. What? Alright, so it's gonna... It's gonna be harder for my Pokemon to fight, I guess. Disregard that last statement. Apparently, it's not gonna be hard for my Pokemon to fight. You'll play for the heck of it. Nice. All right, good. Dio leveled up. You know what? And this is good because Machoke's leveling up too, so that's great. He's almost to level 40. Huh? Seriously? You gotta be kidding. It's over already? What? <laughs> I should have been practicing my battle skills, not my backflip skills. Yeah, pretty much. Thanks for showing me that. Guess I'll cheer for you from now on. Mm-hmm. Oh. Probably disconnect from uh, that so that uh, I'm conserving bandwidth. Team Yell takes the field. This might be the gym challenge, but I won't let you ruin our cool secret hangout. All right, time for pin for a pincer attack. We'll do whatever it takes to win. Ah, I didn't have enough time to get my disguise ready. <laughs> That's right, Team Yell is actually made up of Spike Month Gym trailer, uh, Trainers. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need to save... Uh, yeah, we need to save Bandwidth, and we don't want drop frames exactly, Kevr. The Owl Armor and the Crown Tundra looks pretty good. Yeah, they do. They do. I'm wondering if they'll have additional regions to add to Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Do you know what I mean? I mean, after that. Maybe I'm thinking too far ahead. Hmm. Go, Dio. Oh, nice. Good double hit. Awesome job there, Dio. All right. And now it's time for Rapidash's attack. Alright, very good. Rapidash levels up as well. Uh, should an old move be forgotten or replaced with Dazzling Gleam? Uh, let's forget the old moves. Let's see what we got here. Dazzling Gleam. The user damages opposing Pokemon by emitting a powerful flash. Ooh, that sounds cool. It's a fairy type attack. Oh! I definitely want this, right? 80... Yeah. Get rid of confusion. I don't like using confusion as much. Yeah, they showed the they showed off the bottom and the left, but not the right. There you go, orange. Yep. All right, so we learned Daz, Daz and Gleam instead. Now Rapidash is gonna use Fairy Wind. Did not kill Drapion, and he uses Poison Fang. Thank you for poisoning my Pokemon. Freaking. Oh, I hate that. Oh wait, never mind. He didn't poison. Poison blah, 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 blah. Poison him. He's Pyro Ball against him. 
and Dazzling Gleam. If if Pyroball doesn't kill him off, Dazzling Gleam will. Oh, I love that shot. Awesome. Oh man, come on. Machoke needs to level up, man. Uh, did I lose as a member of Team Yell, or was I beaten as a gym trainer? <laughs> Need a ground type move. Oh, uh, whatever. Our gym leader's up next, but he's really strong. Got that? I mean, everybody already knew the true identity of Team Yell, right? That means I won't get in trouble for not getting in my disguise or my disguise on, right? So I sure hope so. Who cares? Shut your gob. Oh, Jamie. Uh, I'm really sorry. The lot from Spike Month is telling me they locked down the city for my sake. Spike Month just keeps getting worse and worse, and all Pierce says is don't worry. So, so we decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other challengers. We thought if we could stop the other gym challengers from reaching the gym, then Ms. Marnie would be the only one to win and make it to the Champions Cup. And we figured that increased the chances of our wonderful Ms. Marnie becoming the new champion. That's no way to help someone at all. Jamie, no need to bother with all the preparations or whatever. Go on in and face the gym leader. Oh, they don't even have a proper gym here. There. Let me look at this map. Yeah. There's no proper gym. They don't have a proper gym here. Very weird. Does that mean we won't be able to Dynamax? Oh, it's Pierce. They kind of do, but not a stadium, yeah. Wow. My, uh, my character definitely looks out of place. So you're finally here, huh? See, I'm... I'm really not a gym leader. Figured that's why nobody was coming to challenge me. I have good ears, so I overheard the whole thing about the city being shut up. When I was alone, I was like my soul was weeping. This is a simple gym stadium. We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon. But, well, I still hope you enjoy the battle. Now then. I'm the gym leader of Spike Month. Piers, the dark type user. <laughs> DJ5189. No big boys this time. Uh, apparently not. Apparently not. You want to challenge me even though you know you'll lose? And this song for this song's for you, foolish trainer. Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party. Spike month, it's time to rock. As expected, you can't Dynamax. Yeah. You're challenged by Gym Leader Piers. Oh, he gets his own music too. Send out Scrafty. Alright, Dio, I'm gonna need you to make quick work of Scrafty here and just everyone cheer on my Pokemon. Let's do it, Scrafty. Intimidate the opponent. Dang, man. Two times and Scrafty's still in it. Payback? Ah, uh, dang it. There we go. Let's 
sand attack. Oh no. Accuracy fell. All right, let's get Scrafty off the stage. Come on, get him out of here. Get him out of here, Dio. No, not good enough. He's old-fashioned like that. Yeah, I see that. Speed up. Avoided the attack, no. Ah, come on. Okay, don't avoid this attack. Get him. There we go. Now his speed increases. Awesome. Next turn, I've got to heal him. go. Use the Hyper Potion this time. Oh, dang. Good thing I healed, uh... Dang. All right, we got to get Rapidash back on stage. my favorite Pokemon right now it's it's uh it's Eevee but I'm not using Eevee so maybe actually I think Dio is my favorite right now Obstagoon huh Come on, get him. Nope. Not powerful enough. You have two boxes of Eevees? Dang, man. Oh, you're shiny hunting. Dang. Poor, poor Dio. Wasn't ready for that. Alright, let's get Joe Taro out here. Machoke made it to level 40 now. Awesome. Sending out Skunk Tank. Current Pokemon. I don't do on course. Get it? Not socks, not moves, not Pokemon. Okay. You got this, Jotaro. Everyone's gonna stink, but who cares? Go Skunk Tank. Use your Sucker Punch and Toxic. No. No. Oh man, not that attack. What does that do? Lowers my defense? Yep. 
Sucker Punch. Ah, dang it. Dang, half damage. Uh, one more time, one more time. Nice. Should be one more after this, I believe. Nice. Oh, never mind. We're done. Oh my gosh. Me and my team give it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. <laughs> nice job. Nice job. Very good. I'm glad we we're able to battle. Seems like my Pokemon feel the same way. Here's your dark badge. Nice. Two more badges to go. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Here's a uniform too. I actually been thinking about just selling them at my concerts. Little sis Marnie's gonna challenge me next, I bet. That was actually kind of sweet. So you were watching, sis. You won't learn anything from seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro. It's how I learn to battle and all that. That right. That reminds me. Marty, there's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here at Spike Month as its gym leader. Yeah, I know. You'd plan to retire after the Champions Cup, right? I think you've really become a great gym leader, even if you don't Dynamax your Pokemon. I love you, but my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be a gym leader. Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skill to be a champion. Hey Jamie, thanks for having an amazing Pokemon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off a bit, okay? Nice, alright, so that ends that. You seriously beat Piers? Here, a TM to remember this moment. Alright, so we got a TM85 Snarl. Awesome. Put that in our TM pocket. Hey, there's some trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad, even the champions come to sort things out. Oh, hey, you gave Piers a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over here to- er, or head over there to help. Come on, then. I'll show you the way. Wow. Trouble already? We haven't even left the, uh, we haven't even left Spike Month yet. Jamie, thanks for coming, but I've got a handle on this. Whatever's making that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep your eye on the goal. And for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only gym, gym badge left is the one you get from the dragon gym leaders. Uh, oh, Raihan, that's right. He's the last one. Raihan is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. He's, he's that good, you know. And there I go again. Sorry, but I suppose this is no time for me to be stopping for a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it. But don't you worry about a thing. The unbeatable champion is here to take to look after things and keep you all safe. It came from the tunnel, wouldn't you say? Seems I'm about I'm about to have a champion of a time. Let's go find out what's going on over here. What's this? The earth is shaking. Maybe if you try to sway the same way. Nope, not helping. I had to push through the crowd <laughs> to get through. Uh, is he gonna battle us again? This is mad, you know what I mean? Where's Leon? That's what I'd like to know. That noise, it was like some massive explosion. There was this huge surge of red light, and then wild Pokemon just started dynamaxing, dynamaxing around, uh, around me, brazen as you like. Uh, no? 
Oh, okay, here we go. Take a look at the news. See, there's Lee. He's really he really is the greatest, right? Alright, Orange, have a great night. Thanks for dropping by, buddy. I appreciate it. Lee and his Charizard took down that Dynamax Pokemon in the blink of an eye. I knew Lee was strong, but this really makes you appreciate how great he is, eh? Let's go meet up with him, Jamie. He should be at Hammerlock Stadium. Oops. Alright, guys. I think this is a good stopping point for the game. We are going to go ahead and tackle, uh, you know, what comes next, uh, you know, uh, a week from today so if you guys are interested you know come back by here uh and uh join us for the next pokemon sword live stream but for now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go look for a raid target we're gonna go help out another youtube gaming content creator here on the platform we've got 11 of you that are still watching the show right now so let's see who we can help out all right guys we are going to go raid... Let's see who else is live streaming Pokemon right now. Alright guys, Adoran Gaming, he is live streaming Pokemon Sword right now. Looks like he just got started with the game and actually... I thought he was live streaming... Pokemon. Looks like he's in his kitchen. You know what? We're going to raid him anyway, guys. We're going to raid him anyway. While he raids his kitchen, we will raid Adoran Gaming. Yeah, it looks like he started about two hours ago. Maybe he's uh, getting a snack or something like that, you know? Yeah, it'll be interesting. We'll go raid his channel. Let me post a uh, the name of his channel there. It's Adoran Gaming. We use hashtag Clark Raid in the chat. Before we go, let me go ahead and do a shout out for all of my sponsors who are supporting my channel through YouTube memberships. Shout out to my Super Live VIP agent Pyro, my Super Live sponsors Juanito506, Slayer Rocker83, Demon Ninja Tarek Terry, Christian Echevera, Car Designer Krika, Tommy Meadows, Fire Emblem TJ, Arjon1277, Gitothi, and RTG. My Super Live fans, Unknown Gaming, GameZone King AJ, McKirby McMonsta, Angel, Diamond Flumpty, and Paul. Jan McPhillip, or Philip, Spanish Dude, Ryder Ross, Ty the Tuber, and Kever M. Guys, thank you so much for your continuing sponsorship as YouTube members. If you guys want to become a sponsor for my channel, you can join for as little as $1.99. You'll get exclusive access to loyalty badges, custom emojis, Discord perks, and access to our member-exclusive Minecraft realm. So if you guys are interested, hit the Join button today. All right, guys. Yes, that is going to be it for tonight's live stream of Pokemon Sword. Guys, go raid Adoran Gaming. Here is the link to his live stream that is in progress. Guys, thank you so much for coming by and joining us tonight. I do appreciate it. Thank you for the support and interest. You guys are awesome. I uh, do hope that you all will come back and join us again tomorrow night. We will be live streaming Again, I'm not sure what game we're going to be live streaming, but we will be live streaming at 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific, our usual time. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this live stream, be sure to smash that like button. Remember, your likes and comments definitely help the channel grow. More importantly, guys, if you're new to my channel and if you are not subscribed to my channel yet, please consider subscribing and hit the notification bell next to it. That way you guys can be notified when the next live stream is posted. We're going to go raid Adoran Gaming. Use hashtag Clark Raid in the chat. Hit the link in the live stream chat now. And we'll see you all at the next live stream. Take care, everybody.